Let's see this question asked in the examination of CBSE 2002 year. It says if two die are rolled 12 times, so the number of trials are 12, means n is given to you as 12. Right. Obtain the mean and variance of the distribution of successes if getting a total greater than 4 is a success. So there are many cases in which you get the total as greater than 4. And if I see getting a total greater than 4 is a success, so how can you see the sample space accordingly? So many cases are there like 1, 4, 1, 5, 1, 6, 2, 4, 2, 5, 2, 3, many cases are there. So it will take a long time to count. So this methodology is very long, very tedious. So better we see when do we do not get 4. We do not get 4 in the cases 1, 1, 1, 2, 1, 3. And even it said greater than 4. So when do we not get greater than 4? Means we can also get equal to 4. Now after that it will be greater than 4. Similarly, 2, 1, 2, 2 is fine with us. But after that it will be greater than 4. Similarly, 3, 1 is fine with us. But after that it will be greater than 4. So these are in all how many cases? 6 cases are there wherein I see that the total is not greater than 4. That means if getting a total greater than 4 is a success which is P, so here this is Q. So this is how we will be doing this. So now I start with the basic solution. The probability of failure would be these cases which will be 1 by 6 that is 6 over 36. So probability of success will be 5 by 6. N is the number of trials which is 12. So what is the mean? Simply the mean and the variance for this question have the answers as mean is NP which is 12 into 5 by 6 which is nothing but 10 and what is the variance which is NPQ so NP is already done let's simply multiply by Q so this becomes 5 by 3 so these are the two answers which are respectively 10 and 5 by 3.